Good morning, traders. This is Dennis Cahigas from MF Global. It is Tuesday, October 11th, and this is a morning currency comment. Uh, starting off our trading day today, we do have the U.S. dollar strengthening against the other major currencies, and on the overnight, Treasury prices are advancing. Um, early expectations for the trade day today is a bit of that turnaround Tuesday action. Uh, we expect both the dollar and the Treasury to continue their trend as they both advance throughout the day. In a nutshell, for the day today, we do expect the markets to continue to be focused upon Europe. Um, we uh, have no scheduled U.S. news or domestic news coming out until closer towards the end of the week. And as far as the European uh, focus goes, uh, we are looking for the concern in Europe to be focused less on the sovereign debt crisis of Greece, but more on the European um, financial uh, or banking system. Early this morning, the Troika, that is the EU, the uh, ECB, and the IMF announced early that Greece will receive its next aid package scheduled out early in November. That is going to ease a bit of the concern for, for the sovereign debt crisis. Well, let's step back and look what brought us here this morning. Starting off here with the Asian markets. Asian markets closing higher here on the you know, overnight with the Nikkei up about 2%. Uh, the, uh, the Asian stocks did rally here, uh, particularly the Japanese stocks did rally here. Um, on, on support here that both uh, uh, France and Germany will, will support their banking systems. Again, uh, the Japanese markets were closed yesterday for a holiday. Uh, also, uh, the September Japanese consumer confidence was reported m higher than expected last night. That is the highest in six months. That does uh, put the Japanese yen stronger against the U.S. dollar here early this morning. In European news, the European markets are currently lower. The European stocks 50 down about uh, six tenths of a percent. Now, a concern here for uh, for their financial or the banking system last night, as the European Central Bank President Trichet did make comments about the gravity of the situation in Europe, uh, effectively saying that uh, the concerns in Europe are systemic, that the uh, problems of the financial system may not just slow down only in Europe, but also around the world. Uh, later today, the markets will also be anticipating the vote here in Slovakia. Slovakia is scheduled to re-vote for their uh, ratification of the European Financial Stability Fund after the vote failed yesterday. Uh, uh, traders, please remember that it takes all 17 member European nations uh, to ratify that before that bailout package becomes available. This is what's also helping, uh, helping causing concern on the, the stability of the financial system. The euro did slide here against the dollar here here last night on, on, that, on that news. In U.S. markets, uh, currently we are looking for lower. The December Dow is uh, trading down about 5 tenths, suggesting a lower open early this morning. Later today, the only news we are looking for in the U.S. is for the FOMC minutes to be released later on about 1 o'clock Chicago time. But let's break down our trade expectations, starting off with the U.S. dollar. Look for the, for the dollar to strengthen against the other currencies or the cur other currencies to push lower against the dollar. Look for the dollar to test resistance up, uh, up above at 78.50. And for the treasuries, we're also looking for them to trade a slight bit higher through, uh, throughout the day today. Look for the 10 years to toast, test overhead resistance at uh, 129 and for the 30 year we're looking for a test of 141 yesterday we did hit our uh, our target of 138.20 on the 30 year but if you like more questions uh, if you have any more questions on these markets or more importantly if you'd like to know what this could mean for you or your portfolio give me a call at my trade desk at 866-631-6216 please remember that futures trading does involve a substantial amount of risk and may not be suitable for everyone good luck good trading